Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to the Kiwi Lads channel. Today I have got another game of the Mitre 10 Cup. We are in round 3, and this is match 5, Auckland versus Manawa 2. I am going to be Auckland for this match. We are at Eden Park, and let's hope we can get the win here. This match is set to be a good one as these teams go head to head. This match could easily tip in either direction. It'll just need the right spark. With me here is Justin Marshall. And plenty at stake in this game, Justin. Oh, absolutely. It's set for some good rugby. Okay, There's so the lineups. The We've got a very strong Auckland side, you'd this say. Even match up on paper. We've got the so Ioani brothers, of course, the and then our back line. We've got Caleb Clark on the hands. wing. TJ Fiani at centre. So they've got a couple good players too. Nii Mulnaskutta at 15. And they have got Aaron Smith starting at number 9. Harry Plummer to kick us off. There is a bit of wind at Eden Park. Kicks off deep. Kick off nicely. Well taken. Oh, they're going with the big passes straight away. Oh, that looked like he wanted to do a little flick out the back. Oh, good job from Blake Gisborne there. Gibson, sorry, not Gisborne. Aaron Smith gets the ball away. Oh, and I two under pressure. Hoskins Satutu almost able to grab that one. Right, we have turned that one over. Goes out wide to Manu, who hasn't quite got the pace, sadly. Wetton. Goes out to Rico Ioani, who goes to Waller, who goes to Fiani, who does an awkward one back to Rico Ioani. It took a very long time for him to be able to clean that ball up. Crafton goes to Fiani. That was a nice little bit of play from a couple forwards going out to the back. Plummer goes to Hodgman, who goes wide to Manu. No one is going to catch him from there. There's the first try. Just showed great pace there to score the try. He only needs a little space to work with. Pure entertainment. For Noa Manu. We show some nice patience there. We weren't trying to go for it every single time. We were willing to take a couple hit ups. Ruru goes to Plummer. Goes to our number one who goes out wide to Manu. Nice little bit of build up play leading up to that. Not sure if Fiani wants to spend all day running at number ones, but <laughs> in the end it did work out. Tamua Manu scores the opening try of this match. And Auckland, with this kick, could be seven points ahead. Harry Plummer. The wind is straight behind him, so it shouldn't be difficult. And he has kicked that one. Auckland 7-0 up over Manawa 2 early in this game. About 12 minutes in, I believe we are. Manawa 2, 2 kick off. He has gone high. The wind might take that one. Oh, oh, chuck that back infield. He's done very well there. Rico Ioani finds a gap. Oh no, it was a Kiri Ioani. My bad. He did have plenty of pace though. Hodgman goes out. Oh, but Rico Ioani unable to grab that one. They have kicked that. It is a swirling one. Caleb Clark cleans that up well, but he has been driven backwards. Oh, and Jonathan Ruru gets a very good kick away. And he is chasing hard as well. It's not going out. Oh, good hit there from Rico Ioani. Almost gets that back. Oh, advantage. We can chuck everything at that. Ruru's just being decapitated. Akira Ioani goes wider to Fiani, who cuts on the inside, but has been tied up. And they have stolen that butt. We were still under advantage. You know what, what a kick from Jonathan Ruru. Caleb Clark cleaned the ball up five metres out from our line. 
Ruru just heaves it downfield. Oh, but Manoa too are going to take that back. Scrum not working well at the moment. The defence preparing themselves here. Very nimble on his feet there. Good hit there from Waller. No one's joining the drive. Because controlling it at the back. Oh, it's being booted down the middle because, of course, Waller is our fullback. Has anyone got the pace? Ruru has so on that. Rico Ioani playing halfback now. It's an awkward camera angle. He's just going to give it a hoof. He is chasing hard, though. This game is... Oh, he's been stepped. Good hit there from Scott Scrafton back to his feet. He does it so well. It's still alive on the this game side. looks like it's going to be a kicking one. That's oh, an interesting looking pass. Just going to give everyone a bit of time to reset. Work out what they're going to do. Goes to Waller. He goes out to Plum who offloads to Manu. What an offload. And Manu scores in the corner. Second of the match for Tamua Manu. Ruru goes to Hodgman. Goes to Fayani. Good pass to our number 15 Waller. Plummer offload. Debatably forward. But Aaron Smith unable to catch Manu in the corner. It's just good backline play from Auckland at the moment. Yeah, that's a tad forward. Not gonna lie about it. Manu gets his second, Harry Plummer. It's not going to be an easy kick, but he has got the benefit of the win straight behind him. And he has got it straight down the middle. Auckland 14-0 up over Manoa 2 at the moment. Although Manoa 2, they do look dangerous. So I don't think they're out of this game yet. And the kickoff is made here. It's being kicked off. Who's calling for it? Wetton is smashed in the tackle. We love a bit of territory play. Oh, he took his time kicking that. But Jonathan Roo, that's going to set up beautifully. Can Caleb, Cla 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 Can Caleb Clark grab that one? There's the ball. Number 15, playing halfback. Fayani goes out, but it has been intercepted. And of course, our number 15 has now got to try and get back, which he has. Fayani makes that tackle. We are looking dangerous on attack. They are defending relatively well at the moment. That is the halftime buzzer. Oh, Caleb Clark has been nailed there. Oh, no, someone's got to pick it up. No, no one wanted it. Which means we are going into halftime. 14 nil up. Decent half, though, for Auckland. We had a lot more position, more territory. Three apiece for handling errors, which isn't too bad for our standards. And we had three line breaks. Can we continue on with this? It's not a dominant performance, but it's getting up there in this second half. Dwanga Fussy tries to grab that, but then number 14 has wet and has made the tackle, though. And they held this ball perfectly. Aaron Smith round the side. Gets away from Akira Ioani. No, it wasn't. It was our number four. Decent meters made on that charge. Release. Big, big charge. Well, that's a bit of a gap opening up for the man with two backs. Oh, he's just sold the dummy to two different people. Scott Scrafton, though, makes the tackle. Stringing some phases together. And he gets smashed in the Oh, Hodgman forces him backwards. Manoa 2 look like they've come out to play in this second half. They are getting some movement in their back line. Rico Ioani though makes that tackle, rips it away from him. Scrafton passes to Fayani, who passes to Manu, who goes to doing a fussy. He wants to run down the wing, but he hasn't quite got the pace, I don't believe. 
Luru kicks that downfield. It's absolutely smashed by Aaron Smith. Manu does not pick that ball up though. Oh. It's back and forth rugby here. Oh, they've found a gap up the middle. Has Rico Ioani got the pace to catch him? I'm not sure he does. No, he doesn't. And Manua too, off a few mistakes from myself, have scored their first try of the match. Grayson Moala is the try scorer. There, that ball there. I thought it was going to be Manu. So he has made a tackle though. And Manua too, looking like they want to use their backs. They want to offload. They want to play some fast rugby here. And this might be the difference. If they can keep playing like that, could be getting back up to an even contest very soon. Casey O'Connor is their kicker. O'Connor with the kick, looking to add points. Oh, yes he does. Score now 14-7. We are kicking off now. You can feel the tension mounting, can't you? It's still very much anyone's game. Harry Plummer is the one kicking off for us. This game just got a little bit closer, and I'm not as confident anymore. As they are offloading for fun at this point, Manoa too. Aaron Smith checks both sides. More bounds. Alalatoa can see it in there. Aaron Good Smith. tackle from our number 15. That time. He will need to get back though, Absolutely. or else if they kick this all, oh, never mind. He has intercepted that. Ruru has the ball. Hoskins Satutu has a bit of a run at the line. I believe they've kept this for Auckland. Give it a wet in. He tries to shove number 10 off O'Connor but is unable to. Blake Gibson goes out to Caleb. I'm struggling with his name. It's a simple one. Caleb Clark. Hoskins Satutu is not involved in that play. Just like saying his name I guess. But it is a scrum to us. Set. Auckland get a good hit on here. And a good battle going on here. We have kept that scrum. Hoskins Satutu, he's involved in that one. Off the back, Ruru goes to Rico Ioani, who scores. Yes, he's over. Well, how significant a try will that be? Had to get him involved. That man, Rico Ioani. He is pretty good, I have to say. We win our scrum. Jonathan Ruru decides he wants number eight to take it. Hoskins Satutu goes offload to Ruru who passes it. Rigo Ioani finds the gap and it is a try to Auckland. Conversion to Harry Plummer is our Plummer kicker. Lines this one up. The wind's straight into him this time. In the first half it was behind him. And he has got that one. Score now 21-7. That is good. Very good. Play. I am a lot more comfortable with a 14 point difference than a seven I'll be honest. O'Connor to kick off. Here's the kickoff. Kiriwani lines that one up, Ioane takes it well. It was a bit awkward for him, but he has done well. Release. Players only just arriving now. Rico Ioani, first receiver, goes out to Caleb Clark. Has he got the pace? He stepped on the inside. He almost tripped the number 14, but they have ripped the ball away from him. Hoskins Satutu with a big hit there. Aaron Smith off the back. Has been tackled, but we are unable to take that one. Jonathan Ruru forces him out. He's been taken out of play there. First line out of this match, I believe. Which seems strange with the fact that we've done about five kicks each team and no one's found the touch line. Oh, and that's more on their side. One and they have got that one Manoa too. The the so, just a few minutes remaining here. So Tutu, isolated, got the ball. Fayani takes that, passes out to Manu, who chucks it to his side. To absolutely no one. Ruru is going to kick this one. No, he's not. He's been forced back. Akira Ioani takes that one. Done well to keep that. 
Oh, they've only got a few minutes to make some. Hodgman gets it. Goes out to Rico Ioani, who goes to Plummer. He's looking for Clark on his outside. He has been nailed in the tackle, though. Great work to keep the ball alive here. Wetton goes out to Hodgman. He's been involved in the back line a lot so far. Hey, the match is just about over. The full-time siren is going to be going very soon. There it is. Rico Ioani goes to Satutu, who goes to Fayani, who drops the ball. He does that way too often, I'm sorry. We're not going to commit to this. The number eight moves it on. How close to the line do you think they'll have to be for the advantage to be over, do you yeah, think? That's a more. Gonna let them do this. Advantage over. Here. Right, the advantage is over, we're in. Gotta get this ball back now. If they score now, that would be slightly unfortunate. Good hit there. Blake Gibson makes that tackle. Can we steal that one? Come on. I want this ball back. We're going to get a runaway try if we can get it. Good tackle there. We are committing men very early to those breakdowns. They just don't want to give the ball up. Oh, Tuanga Fussy is shoved off. Oh, that was close. Aaron Smith. Oh, looking dangerous here. Manoa 2. Is that our ball? Yes, it is. Right. Ooh, right, what do we do here? We're going to go this way. We've gone to Akira Ioani. Oh, it's been intercepted though. No. And Manoa 2 score in the 92nd minute. We did all the hard work of getting that ball back. It took us 10 minutes of constant defence. We finally got it back in our first backline movement. We go to Akira Yuani who does a floaty pass trying to find Plummer. And Manawa to score. It was Sakalia for Manawa to who scored that try. Unfortunately. Well intercepted there by their number 12, their prop drives over Sakalia. And the game is going to finish to just that little bit two, closer, man. which is unfortunate. We did play well up until that point, I felt. O'Connor sizing up this kick. And the kick is he over. does convert Casey O'Connor. Get the win. An excellent contest here. It is a win. Auckland not as happy with it as they could have been. Really wanted to score one more try. But I guess in a way, someone did score one more try. So, you got to take the good with the bad. Yes, it wasn't us, but we did get to see one more before the end of the game. Manoa 2 scored twice. Sakalia and Moala. O'Connor converting both of them. And for us, Yuani scored one. That is Rico, of course. And then Tamua Manu scores the other two. Plummer converts all three. Possession 50 50. And everything else, you'd have to say, was relatively close. What was starting out as a kicking game became more of a running game in that second half. And there were some pretty exciting plays. Anyway, that's the end of this video. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one.